On Saturday, the Mustangs are looking for their first win of the season coming off a 2-2 tie to Milton. They face Weymouth in Weymouth. Early on in the first, Weymouth goaltender leaves it out for junior Chris Martin, who will gather it from behind the net to stuff it in for an easy 1-0 lead. In a full-line effort, sophomore Anthony Marchand dumps a puck to Martin to dish it to senior assistant captain Cal McHugh, who goes top shelf to double the Mustang lead. Yeah! Mustangs looking to further extend their lead with junior Joe Spadorsha with a kick pass to linemate Sean Monroe, who is denied by the Weymouth goaltender. Later on in the second, Wildcats senior captain rips one through everyone to cut the Mustang lead in half. <laughs> 20 seconds later, number five for Weymouth flies down the ice to even it up at two. Brandon Walsh looking to take back the lead, hustling by Weymouth defenseman, but his chance tipped into the netting by the Wildcat goalie. Sean Monroe dishes into the slot, which is picked off by Weymouth winger. That leads to a breakaway goal for Weymouth's first lead of the night, 3-2. Yeah! Just under 30 seconds to go in the middle period, Weymouth center takes it all the way around the net and throws it out front for another Weymouth goal. Right away in the third, the Wildcats come out firing. The Cats' right winger tips it by Aiden Rudin, only to be denied by Austin. Just over 13 and a half to go, Sporsha tips it by the defenseman for a two-on-one, finished off by captain Sean Monroe. Well, that wouldn't be enough for the Mustangs, who do fall to the Weymouth Wildcats 4-3. Reporting for you, Stang Sports, I'm Joe Sporsha.